<sighs> Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick. We are back on the Witcher 3 uh, Wild Hunt Blood and Wine DLC. We are going to be finishing up the Gwent. I decided we'll finish the Gwent up <laughs> and then we'll be done with Gwent uh, other than playing random games against people that I run into, I guess. If there's any of that in the DLC, uh, we'll go ahead and do that. But other than that, we're going to finish up Gwent here. Finish the tournament, and then we'll have the Gwent out of the way, and we will start uh, progressing the story and whatnot and doing side quests that aren't Gwent. Uh, but I thought it was time we just finish Gwent up early in here, and then we'll, uh, we'll get started on everything else. But let's talk to Kat Monayer. Greetings. I trust you've reconsidered your decision. Will you try your luck in our tournament, after all? All right, I'll give it a shot. Play using the new faction. That is an exceedingly good rub to my loins. What Just the remember hell? the cards I gave you form, but the base deck. No chance I can win the tournament with these cards? An issue easily resolved. You must simply face local Gwent competitors, win the missing cards from them. Besides, it would be very good practice for the tournament itself. Already got a good enough deck to play in the Tournament of Skellige. Might I have a peek? You do indeed. Come back in two days' time, then, for the start of the tourney. Dude, this dude just said a nice rub in his loins. Like, what the hell? Like, what the hell is that? My question is, if you fuck this up, can you actually, like, miss this tournament and then you're just out of luck? Hold on. I don't know if this is the ter if it's I like um, the tournament in the regular game where if you lose you're kind of effed. Uh, we're going to save to make sure that doesn't happen because I want to win the tournament. And if that requires me to cheese, then I'm going to cheese. Take good care of you. Alright, it hasn't been two days yet. Okay, there we go. Let's go all the way around again. Go to the morning. We could play some late... We could do this late night, Gwent. Let's do Gwent at night, a midnight tournament. Not that it matters what time of day, but let's do this. I shiver just looking at him. Eat, drink, and be merry. Thus spake the prophet Lebiota. There you are. A pleasure to see you again. The Skellige faction. How do you find it? I'm gonna be honest. Honestly, not one of my favorites. Hmm. Yet I believe you will easily win the tournament wielding it. Any specific tournament rules? Mind giving me an overview? Firstly, might I introduce the contestants? Superb Gwent players all, hailing from the world's farthest corners. Hamal Ochen Dankbali, an Ofieri merchant. Eric van Frog, a patrician from Novigrad. And lastly, we are proud to welcome a Skelliger. Ye blind? Not Skelliger, Skelligirl, damn it! Naturally, no offense meant. Agnetha Skolt. Her effort charming isle temperament in evidence, along with assorted beats, baubles, ropes. As to the rules, they're simple. Each player adopts a faction they cannot change for the tourney's duration. Lose a match, and you're eliminated. The winner from among you shall advance to the semi-final to face the winner of the tourney's previous edition, His Excellency the Ambassador of the Empire of Nilfgaard, Master von Hill. The winner of that match shall in turn face none other than me, your humble servant. Hand off our Gwent! No new fucking factions! Protesters have gathered outside. Quite a few, it seems. Hands off our bloody game! We didn't want any new factions! Money, you dozy cunt! Stop doubling with dwarven tradition! Change cannot always please everyone. 
Gwent traditionalists resent my efforts to expand the canon to include Skellige, but we shall pay them no mind. Mind telling me what factions the others will be playing? It is no secret. Eric van Frog will play the Northern Realms. His Excellency, in a flush of patriotism, chose Nilfgaard. Hamal Ochendagbali will play the Monster Steck, and Agnetha Skold has chosen Skoyatel. Yours truly, of course, shall await the winner with a Skellige deck. I'm determined to prove its value. Ready to start if everybody else is. I invite you to join me on the terrace. The Herald shall soon announce the tourney's start. All right, I can't be can't be screwing up. I don't have any. The issue is, let is the you... tourney begin. In round one, Agnetha Skult faces Eric von Vrog, and Geralt of Rivia plays Hamel on Dangbali. Let's grab a table. A wager? Would you wish to make? What did you have in mind? Weapons do I collect, and your sword of silver my eye has caught. Should I win, I should take it. Should I lose, to you another equally precious shall I give. All right. So be it. The issue is, if I, if I draw a, a shitty hand, I'm just effed. Like, I'm literally just screwed if I, if I draw a bad hand, because I don't have the draw power. I don't have the ability to draw other than Avalok. I have one spy in my deck to draw. So it all comes down to the luck of the draw, really, with this deck. So here we go. Uh, Alright, I'll be honest, it could have been worse. Could have been better. Alright. Eh, not the greatest hand, but I'll take it. Alright, let's give this a go. I have a feeling I'm going to be... This is going to be close. Hmm. Quite a start by him. What do I want to do? I don't hold a lot of options within my hand. Okay, my opponent passed. Ooh, now this gets interesting. Um, I'll double. This is actually really bad. I might actually lose this. What the heck is my ability? That doesn't help me at all. Um, alright. Do this just a waste of turn. Give me this guy back. Well, that's not good at all. I may be in trouble. Yeah, I'm gonna be in some serious trouble here. I might have lost. I don't know if I can win. So that'll end this round. Of course, Dandelion is the card that... Whoa, okay. I'm not sure what the Skellige ability is that triggered there, but... I'll take it. I still think I'm going to lose. I still don't actually think I have a shot to win. Yeah, I don't have a shot to win. These are going to get doubled. Well, it all is going to come to... Uh, yeah, I can't even win. I don't think I can win. I don't think there's a chance. If he doesn't have 10... Yeah. See, man. Damn it. Not just out of the tournament. Lost my sword, too. Thus in life goes it ever. One's fortune, another's misfortune requires. For a match good, thank I you. 
I'd never have lost if you hadn't cheated. And my land folk who slander like that don't live long, because we don't let them. Accuse me of cheating again, and I'll cut your tongue out. Enough. Hands to yourselves. As Gwent is a gentleman's sport, we expect all its players to demonstrate impeccable manners, and we cannot tolerate any disturbances. Thus, by decision of Count Monier, the contestants from Novigrad and Skellige are hereby disqualified. Gentlemen's sport. Well, I'm a lady, and we ladies don't give a flying fart about a tourney where any measly prick can accuse us of cheating. With round one completed, the standings are as follows. Geralt of Rivia eliminated. Agnetha Skold and Eric von Vrog both disqualified. Consequently, His Excellency the Ambassador of Nilfgaard shall now face Hamal Ong Tangbali. Congratulations. Good win. Thank you. An exciting match, to say the least. In the grand finale, Ambassador von Hin shall face Count Monier. Stop desecrating Gwent! Death to any and all new factions! Seems there's some trouble brewing. Scoot, Olius, off your asses and hide to Skellige. Yeah, I love and seal slappers. Please remain calm and stop the verbal attacks. Stop your mum from fucking ferrets, Monier, and hands off our Gwent! Get out of here before my patience runs thin. Hear that? Guttershy's threatening us. Only one answer to verbal aggression of that sort. Once more, I beg and plead, be calm. Shut your yap, Monier. Enough of this. Didn't come out of Java, but to break fucking heads in defense of tradition. Come on, lads. All right, when this loads in, we're going to... We are going to reload our save that I made because I'm half intelligent. Because I want to win this tournament just because I want to see what it... Like, I feel like this quest the is pointless if you The King of the Wild lose. Hunt sailed aboard the Nagel Fair, a giant longship that traveled between worlds. As Gels had advised, the Witcher set out to find the Sunstone, an artifact needed to draw Aerodin into a trap. All right, Fezimir, shut up. Uh, but I feel like this this episode is pointless if I don't win. Like, it's just going to be a pointless waste of time if I don't win the tournament, because the heck is the point of playing the Gwent tournament if, I can't, if I'm not winning it? Also, the dumb... I hate this Skellige deck, dude. It's worse than... It's like the worst deck. Like, I'm here to say it is my least favorite. I can say that with full confidence because it literally has no draw power. And the cards you get really aren't that good. They actually drive me, they actually drive me a little insane. They suck so much. I'll edit the deck a little bit before we start the next one. I think I might remove a couple some cards. Give me a better shot at drawing something better than what I drew there. Because that, that hand that I got was some straight garbage. Like, there was no real chance of me winning there. There just, there just wasn't a good shot at any point. I wish I could have had... A little bit something better or not had two of the same things in my see if you get those things that bring out um that like summoning that brings out all, all the same ones with the same name if you have them in your hand it's a worthless card you're just wasting cards in your hand at that point you have to get lucky and my god witcher this loading screen dude let's go <laughs> It takes this game so long to load you in. What's new? Right. It doesn't matter what time of day I do this. So let's just get the two days over with. I think it just have to go to here. No. Okay, I'll just do it another day, whatever. 
I thought I could have it at midnight. Get the Kair and to Sant Fun and to Sant. Alright. Oh, it's not even been the two days yet. Why did I save so damn early? Okay, now we can join the tournament. Let me save again. Alright, here we go. Let's try this again. Eat, drink, and be merry. Best I'm gonna skip all the dialogue since we already heard it. And then obviously I will um I will let new dialogue play, but we just heard this. the Nope. Alright, let's do this. Ready to I Let me not get the shittiest hand of 2016. Let it Let's go. A whip. Whip. Oh. Alright. What is the special? Um, two random cards from the graveyard are placed on the battlefield at the start of the third round. Units only lose half their strength. These all suck. I think I'm gonna take... Hmm. I should take something out of this deck. Might be the Young Berserkers. I think they transform into eight, att or eight uh, bears, but I don't really know if that's worth it. Let me just ditch the long ships in this dude. Let's try this deck. I draw a better hand this time, please. Oh, this hand's some straight boo cocky. I gotta get rid of this card. Okay, not. Uh, I'm not gonna sit here and act like this is a really good hand, but it's not horrible. We can make it work. Oh, goody, a Scorch. Alright, well, I'll bring him back. Alright, there's Geralt. Let me draw back. Chick that revives. There's his Avalok. Probably gonna draw another Scorch, knowing my luck. You end your turn. Yeah, there we go. I'll take the W. Alright, I don't have much left in my hand in terms of doing anything, but we'll see. I should be able to get a decent chunk of tech. I might just sit and stall around here for a minute. Oh, just great. Um, shit. Yeah, I'm gonna lose again. Maybe. I mean, there's a chance. I'm not giving myself a good chance, but there's a chance, I guess. As it all comes down to this. Nope, that'll do it. Right there, that'll do it. That will seal my fate, and we've got... Oh, Jesus, I Damn hate it. this deck. Thus, With a I'm fucking passion, dude. I... The... 
Shit. Wait. This deck is so fucking hard to play. Congrats. Thank you. It God, this is a lot of dialogue here. <sighs> Dude, I would embarrass these fools if I could use my good deck. If I could, if I could use the deck I want to use. If I could use my Northern Realms or even the, the King of the Wild Empire. Hunt sailed aboard the Nagal Fair, a giant longship that traveled between worlds. As Gels had advised, the Witcher set out to find the Sunstone, an artifact needed to draw Aerodin into a trap. But if I could just play one of my decks, not, not this crap. This decks, I I hate this deck. Like I don't think it's very good at all. I don't know if I'm playing it wrong or if I should be playing it better. But this deck is just straight ass. Like the Nilf Guardian, or is it? Yeah, the Nilf Card Empire and the Northern Realms are just so much better than the other decks because you can just keep drawing cards out. The monster deck is probably second. Because of the amount of cards that you can draw out with, um, with the summon ability of the cards. Uh, and then the Scoia'tael deck isn't far behind. It's got some good uh, small little quirks in it that, uh, that actually work pretty well. And then there's this trash Skellige deck that we got. Like, I can't even win with this thing. This thing is that trash. I don't know. Like, I don't know if I have... I don't know if I'm going to be able to get... Three W's in a row with this Skellige deck. Might have to. I might have to go practice with this thing and see exactly how how to do it. If we fail in this episode again, that's what I'm gonna. Or I guess if we fail time wise, we'll see where we get to. But I have to. I have to figure this deck out. I mean, I'm just not... I don't know what I'm doing wrong. I don't know what mistakes I'm making. I just I just can't win with this thing. And I don't get it. I don't think I'm that bad of a Gwent player. But this deck is some straight ass. Alright. Here we go. What's it, boots, We'll roll through this dialogue again real quick. And we'll give this yet another try. There you are. Honest. There should be an option that I despise this thing. Because I despise this deck. Ready? I... I literally just what? want this deck to die. That's great. Hey, what? What? Oh. Uh, is there any other card I can ditch out of this deck? I almost want to ditch the Triss card out of this deck. I actually don't think. I think it's less help. I'm gonna ditch the Triss card out of this deck. And now I gotta go through and ditch the rest of the cards that I don't need. These right here. Alright, here we go. Let's try this again. Well, I got Avalok. Hmm. Interesting hand. Interesting hand, to say the least. Very interesting. Just gotta play one card to win. I don't exactly get that pass. It's like the most pointless pass. Um, it's gonna play it slow. So I'm gonna play that card. Hmm. Now I could just pass.
Alright, we're gonna take this... Hmm. No, wait, my ability... Alright, no, we're gonna do it this way. Okay, two of those came from his hand. I'm gonna end my turn here. Alright, so those will get brought back. I could have pulled Ah I made a Ah, I made a mistake. Oh, that's my bad. I'm pissed. That's my bad. I made a big mistake. It's gonna come down to the luck. Actually, I think actually we're good, but I did make a really big mistake there. I should have played another card and sent it to the graveyard so I'd have something to revive with Yen, but we'll see. I think I might actually win this one. Still got the the bear now with 16 attack. I'm waiting for him to scorch the bear. Oh, he's out. I win. Alright, we got win number one on the board in this with the Skellige deck. Got win number one on the board. That was a above average hand. Good match. Thanks. And upon your victory, congratulate I you. What drove me to wager a sword against you know I not. Clearly to guide me the universe ceased. Here, you may it serve well. I'd never have lost if you hadn't cheated. And my land, folk who slander like that don't live long. Cause we don't let them. Accuse me of cheating again, and I'll cut your tongue out. Did we hurt this? As Gwent is a cheat! Thus, by decision of Count Gentlemen's Sport. With Route 1 completed, the standings are as follows Agnetha Skolt and Eric Van Vrog both disqualified. Geralt of Rivia has defeated Hamel Ongenbali of Ophir. In the semi final, Geralt shall face the defending champion, Ambassador Von Heen. I am honored. Oh, this dude's gonna kick my ass. Here we go. Gotta get... I gotta have the luck. Again, this is so rough. I don't think decoys play as big of a part for me. He plays Nilfgaard, though. So I'm gonna want the three. Right, he's playing Nilfgaard, I think. Yeah, so he has spies in his deck. Now the question is, will he use his spies? Alright, I'm this hand's not bad. I'm gonna swap that out. Alright, I'll take it. Interesting little hand here, but I'll take it. We'll see how this goes. We're looking for him to play spies. I gotta hang in. Um It sounds a little crazy, but I do have to hang in here. Yeah, there we go. There we go, buddy. Play me those spies. If I can't get spies, I'll find a creative way to get them. Or if I can't have them in my deck, I'll find a creative way to get them. Alright, not if that's a good draw. I'll take that draw. Okay, so now he's got the strongest card on the field. So now I can just delay a little bit. Wait for another spy, maybe. What is this card's ability? Kills the strongest card on the battlefield. Okay. Let's do this. Now I have the two strongest cards, though. Alright, a pass is in order. Um, yeah, we can pass. Yeah, we can pass. Hmm. I don't like that it's my turn first. Um... What is Cirrus' front line? Okay, we'll play up here. 
This is hard. I'm trying to delay time, but it makes this pretty hard to try to delay this. Go ahead and play her. Draw out some other cards. Well, damn. <laughs> oh, she's gonna... Okay, this is fine. He's gonna bring back the spy. I'll take it. Okay, there's a Scorch. I'll live with it, I guess. And then the hand got shittier. Uh, let's just play that. Oh shit, what did he just draw out of my graveyard? Well, shit has gone from bad to worse. Um... He's got four cards, I've got three. I'll get two random cards back. Hmm. Or I could draw two cards. Ah, oh, this is... Um... I'm playing with fire here. I'm betting against the odds that he has another Scorch. If he has another Scorch, then I lose. It's as simple as that. If I if he has a Scorch, I lose. Like, it doesn't get much more simple than that. Well, here we go. Moment of truth. Does he have a Scorch? Uh, what do I want to bring back? If I bring him back, he's going to kill my... Uh, so let's just do this. It comes down to one card left. He needs five to win. I guess I'll just do that. Oh, you know what? I shouldn't have done that. I'm stupid. Wow, dude! I can't believe it, man. Oh, you know what? Oh! Let's fucking go, boys! I thought for sure I had lost. Let's Your go! Excellency, a pure pleasure to play you. The pleasure was mutual, I assure you. Congratulations, Witcher. Stop desecrating Gwent! Death to any and all new factions! Seems there's some trouble brewing. Scoot, Olius! Yeah, Off your asses and hide the Skellige! Yeah, I love my it. Headset. Seal slappers! Please remain calm and stop the verbal attacks. Stop your mum from fucking ferrets, Monier! And hands off our Gwent! What the fuck just happened? Yo, my door just got blown shut. What the hell? Get out of here before my patience runs thin. Hear that? Got our eyes threatening us. Only one answer to verbal aggression of that sort. Once more, I beg and plead, be calm. Shut your yap, Monier. Enough of this. Didn't come here to Java, but to break fucking heads in defense of tradition. Come on, lads. Alright, now we can actually kick these stupid dwarves' asses real quick. Excellent. Oh god, they're level 39. Oh, we're punching. Oh, we're fist I didn't think we'd fist fight out here. I thought I'd get the kick. Alright, there's one of you down. Hey, mother you gang banging douchebags. Come here. Get the hell out of here. Cooled you off a bit. Fuck. Seeing triple. 
quadruple even. Enough! I shall summon the guard! I got this count. Sure, you can shut this tournament down, but there'll be another, with who knows what new rules. If you don't like them, don't enter. Play somewhere else however you want, but you'll never stop other folk from playing however they like. Bollocks! Like my good friend Zoltan Chive says, if one says you're talking bollocks, they could be right, they could be wrong. But if multiples say you're talking bollocks, well, you probably are. So let's take a vote. Who else here thinks I'm full of it? Zoltan Chive! Haven't seen that rascal in ages. How's he doing? Was in Novigrad last I saw him. Be glad to tell you more over a flask of something strong. Attention, everyone! Our outing's taken a new turn. We're to sit and drink vodka with Zoltan's pal! Gentlemen, wait. We've still the final round of the tourney to play. Final? Fuck that! I, Yaki Raffiberg, to hereby declare my participation in this tournament. And I demand to play the victor. We'll settle whether this Skelliger faction's worth a flaming bag of shit once and for all. Agreed, but please show some patience. We must first play a pre-final. I can tell you that this Skellica deck is a worthless piece of shit. In the uh, pre-final, Count Monnier, representing the Skellige faction, shall face Geralt of Rivia, also playing with a Skellige deck. My brother's dream has come true. Skellige in the final, and played by both contestants. Good luck. Bro, if you, if you want, you can play... Skellige, and I'll kick your ass with another faction. <laughs> because I would like nothing more than to get rid of this. Give me a- oh, I don't have fucking Avalok. Alright, the two Scorches may s Of course he draw- you know, of course he draws Avalok, this cheap little shit. Mm, great. Getting a little taste of my own medicine. I don't like the card advantage that this guy holds right now. Hmm. I don't have a whole lot to work with. Like I'm, I don't have many cards that are gonna save me, or that are gonna help me. This is kind of where it's gonna get interesting. Yo, yo, wait, get out of here with this shit! Wait, it kills it! Oh my god! I didn't think that shit would kill itself. Yeah. Ugh, this is some shit. I'm gonna run out of cards. I am almost out of cards. I literally just have the Siri card in my hand. That's it. I don't have anything else. I'm gonna lose because of this. I don't have anything left to play. Unless you place that, which now I can uh, hit it with the Scorch. Get those out of there. I mean, you got three cards, yeah. I was gonna say, you better pass. Hmm. Now, how do I want to play this? I don't have... I don't have cards enough to... Okay, so I have to just end my turn. I was gonna try something, but nah. I'll just let this go. Well, you get to take the win, buddy. Um, because... 
There's nothing I can do. He's gonna play Dandelion to take it. He's got two cards to my one. It all comes down to- Oh my god! Are you shitting me? That is so lucky. That those are the- out of all the cards that- Oh my god. I can't believe it, man. I cannot believe it. I don't I believe it. No hard feelings, I trust. Skellige won, like you wanted. That's what matters. Skellige won! What a bundle of pish! Tournament's not done! Now, it's my turn. That is what we agreed. Let us resolve our differences here and now. The grand finale! Witness it now! Count Monier playing the Skellige faction against Yaki Raffiberg playing Skyatel! Let the better man or dwarf win! I can't fucking believe I lost to this idiot. Thank you for a scintillating game. I trust my victory has convinced all doubters of the value of the new faction. You won because you played better. Even if you hadn't played as plowing Skellige, you would have won anyhow. Uh, congrats all the same. Yaki Raffibag's no sore loser. Come on, lads. Let's get soused. No, you must stay, for I wish to treat you all to a tipple. We must toast the premier of the new faction. And if anyone wishes to play a friendly match of Gwent, I see no reason why not. Shall you stop using this hot Thank you shit? for everything, Witcher. Don't think that went exactly as you planned. What matters is we played Gwent, and I presented the Skellige faction. I'm sorry you did not manage to qualify for the finals. I'd hoped to face you, but participation alone counts for something. Here, a consolation prize. What the hell is Thanks. he talking about? He beat Thank me! Thank you once more for deigning to take part in my little tour. I hope we shall meet again. Who knows? Farewell. What is this dumbass talking about? He beat me. Was that truly necessary? And our knights, what are they? He beat me. I don't get it. I you got beat by him. No, no, Show respect for our opponents. Best us always. Can I play a friendly match in Gwent? Play final participation is whereas the best amongst us victory would be. Oh my God! Everybody, shut up. How are you? Greetings, Grey Baba. Really, I'm not allowed to play. Ahoy! Ahoy! Please accept my most Excuse me. This year, regards. once more, I aim to prove Nilfgaard knows no equal. Yo, I gotta go play Gwent with a real deck. I can't. I can't. I gotta get. May we hey, all play fair? Witcher? Show us. Was that truly opponents? necessary? Have you seen not the Skellige Isles? We are gonna reset. Um. And I will come back to this quest later and win the tournament. We will win the tournament, I promise you. But we'll come back to it later. I just need... I need that bitch up top, she she plays Gwen. I gotta play with something that's not that trash that I had to just play with. Um, we'll come back to this probably near the end of this Let's Play of the DLC. Holy shit. Even more than I do already. Why can't I play Gwent with any of these guys out here? I felt like that they missed an opportunity there. Like, why can't I have some fun playing them? I had to come in here and play this chick. Welcome to the. Alright. Play me around a Gwent so I can get this garbage out of my... I know you're busy. Out of my memory. Never want to play the Scoyatel garbage again. Give me my, give me my godly deck. All right, I'll take it. I just needed something else other than that trash deck. I needed to play something else. This is going to be a long episode. Well, like I said, I'm going to come back and beat that quest, because why not? 
Probably this dude just passed with a 12. I almost just played the wrong card. Wanted to play Siri. I just take this. Alright. So he got anything to revive in his deck. I would sure hope so. Alright, put Roach out there. Alright, yeah, you can get all your the rest of your cards off this field. Oh, I'll just do it again. Oh, poor... Poor lady. Poor fella. I'm just destroying everything she puts out there. She's, she doesn't have a chance in the world. I can't believe she didn't have something that could revive. Like, that blows my mind. Alright, we'll play one more of this. We'll play one more round of Gwent against her. And then we'll call it a... We'll call it an episode. What kind of crap does she give me for winning Fiverr? Welcome to the... I want to get a round of Gwent where I get all my spy cards. So I can have one round of the... Of the way I love to play Gwent. I need to get this. I know we siege double siege unit. I don't even think I use siege units in this. The, the siege is supposed to be your big thing in this deck. I don't even think I use like any. Uh, well, this deck or this hand kind of blows. All right, it got better. Uh, it got even better. Oh, he's playing Avalok, or she's playing Avalok, so that's a draw for her. Hopefully that means she draws something helpful for me. Yep, a decoy, nice. I need to draw uh, Avalok or some decoys here. No, it didn't. That's kind of bad. Hmm. I do have the ability to revive. I should probably take advantage of that. Bring him back to my hand. Alright, my opponent passed. Alright, nice. Alright, now I'm just gonna do this to take the win. Alright, not a bad draw. Go play Dandelion here first, start it out this way. Oh, freak, of course, with the Scorch. Fine, I'll bring Dandelion back. Alright, we're gonna get to do what this deck is all about. Maybe. Unless I have another Scorch card, which I would not be surprised. Probably should have waited, knowing that there was probably she, that she probably has another Scorch card. All I remember is how OP, how ridiculously OP Scorch was, be like early in the game when the enemy would have Scorch. That's all I remember is how ridiculously stupid OP that was. He might be home free. Now a Scorch would destroy... He's gonna continue to stall some time here. Try to get all the cards out of this per All the cards out of her hand. One more card to go. Alright, we're gonna risk it for the Biscuit. I can't... I couldn't Scorch, really. Okay, no Scorch. Good. Uh, if you were if you were the other person, you'd be like, "Oh yeah, I got this thing in the bag." Until I play two two more of these, and then I have a third one even. Ah, that's what I missed. 
I missed playing this. Alright, let's just end it. Alright! That is gonna do it for this episode, though. I hope you guys enjoyed. Remember, I'll come back and actually win the Gwent tournament in the next, um, or not in the next episode, but near the end of the playthrough. Hopefully I remember I'll come back and complete it. Uh, we're gonna reset my save, so anything we got in this episode will, I will not have in the next one, including that weapon that guy gave me. I guess we can take a look at that weapon real quick, see how good it is, see what I'm giving up. The, the Blave, uh, level 40, and it's only plus 86. I don't actually know how good of a weapon that actually will be. Seeing as it's a, it's a steel sword, which the steel swords tend to be a little bit weaker, uh, but it should be interesting to see. I can't even use that sword anyway, so it's not a big deal about losing it, but we will come back and complete this quest in a later episode, but I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.